Hello people, Strange Templar here, and it is time once again to delve our dangerous and deadly dungeon known as Spelunky. We are once again trying to get our key all the way over to the Tunnel Man because, well, he wants a key to unlock a lock that we probably don't actually care about. But hey, we want to make him happy because when he's happy, we're happy and we have a freaking sh uh, web gun and also a shortcut to the temple. Even though we die every... T I've never made it even close to the end of the temple area. But hey, if we get the shortcut to the temple, we'll be able to practice the temple. Because uh, that's kind of what happened with the ice caves. Ice caves were hard until we practiced them. The forest jungle area thing was difficult until we practiced it. So, my goal is to get that temple thing so we can practice. Because you know what they say, practice makes slightly less unperfect. Uh, I would say practice makes perfect, but you guys have met me. Well, not in person, but you have seen me play. Or, I don't know why you're coming in the middle of, like, episode 30-something, 40-something. We're getting up there! We're getting up there! We have a lot of episodes in, and not very much progress has been made. Although I do feel I'm slowly but surely getting better. Um, it might just be gas, but I'm feeling very productive about life. Um, except for the whole fact that it takes two bombs to save a dog. One rope to get back up after falling stupidly. And our last bomb to get sticky bombs. Those armored trampolines. That's what we call them now. Armored trampolines. As of last episode? The episode before that? I don't know. We started playing around with armored trampolines and it was fun. It was. That's one way. Oh, sorry, dog. Um. Speaking of sorry. No, wait. Can we land? No, I don't feel good about that. Sorry, dog. I choose you. Make me proud. And you're dead. Okay. Well, it kind of made me proud. Do you think there'd be a... Maybe? Maybe? Should we? Yes. It's not about the money, it's about the machete. Yes, clearly. Uh, nope. But we're gonna keep it until we get ourselves a key. Because remember, our whole goal is to get that key to the temple. Hey, free bombs. I approve. I approve free bom free bombs all the time. I almost said free broms. I don't know what broms are. Unless you play Fallout, and then the Brahmin are the uh, cows, the two-headed cows in Fallout, which is a great series, by the way. Pre-Bethesda and post-Bethesda. Um, you can't go wrong with the Fallout series. Uh, Fallout Tactics, one of my favorite games of all time. Even though I've never beat it. It's one of those games, like Final Fantasy Tactics. Basically, any game that has the word tactics in it is probably one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, I really enjoy strategy games, even though I'm not the best at them. Uh, they're just different. I like, I like using my noggin, even if I'm not very good at it. You know? You know. Uh... Crap, dog, there's no way to rescue you safely. I'm sorry. I'm not even gonna try. I mean, I could try, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to. That's basically where we're at. That dog is not gonna get saved at all. All right, so. Bat. I wish you could fly into spikes and kill yourself. Wouldn't that be awesome? You know what else would be awesome? Stealing that shotgun. Even though I'd only get it for a turn, it's not worth it. And by a turn, I mean one level. Remember, guys, we have to get the key from the mines all the way to the freaking end of the ice caves. Do you know how hard that is? Do you know how hard it is for me to get to the end of the ice caves in general? Uh, speaking of keys, there it is. I was going to say it's on the map because there's the... Watch him a dinger. 
And by Witch Miniger, I mean locked chest. Uh, okay, so we're gonna drop like so. Take that. Perfect. If we get a Kapala, that would make life much easier. Um, I just don't like having to juggle the key and the dog. Um, especially if you have to, like, get it, the dog to the end. If both did, well, clearly the key's gonna be with me from the beginning. And if the dog's at the top as well... Whoa! Oh! No! No! Are you... Ah. But what I was saying was... Ah, oh, that sucked. What I was saying was, um... Item juggling is still probably one of my hardest things to do. And also the random... Holy crap, you just got impaled for no good reason. Because a arrow shot over your head, ricocheted off a wall, bounced, ran into an explosive crate, and then caused you to die. I was, I was talking to my friend earlier, and I was like, you know, uh, there's hard games. Like, Binding of Isaac is a hard game. Because it gets, like, the further you go, the more difficult it becomes. But in Isaac, if you make a mistake, yeah, you can recover. In this game, one misstep and you're dead. Perfect run goes to nothing. Goes to, ha, you're dead. Sucks to be you. You need to find a new job. Preferably one that requires not breathing since you're dead. Um, and it's just not a very, uh, it's not a very forgiving game. That's all I'm trying to say. Very unforgiving. But that's what I like about it. I hope you guys still enjoy watching this because I still enjoy playing it. Even though I die in the most ridiculous ways, it's still fun. I'm still finding new and clever ways to die. Like, arrow over the head, off the wall, bounce into a exploding crate, and then get propelled into a spike pit while a spider is eating my brains and a zombie skeleton thing is tickling my toes thing. Kind of like that. Um, and yeah, every, every day is a new day to die. A new way and a new day. Just every day is new. Okay, you're stuck. And I still say money isn't what we're going for, but I'm still gonna grab it anyways because you can buy some awesome stuff at the shop. Such as spring boots, climbing gloves, and if we had just a little bit more money, which we can get right here, we could buy a pitcher glove, which I'm not sure if I really want, to be completely honest. Um, one, because I always forget that I have it, and two, because um, every time... Like, sometimes I just want to throw some something in an arc, right? Arcs are generally more helpful than straight lines uh, when it comes to this game. Uh, but I don't know. I think I think we're going to save our money for a jetpack or something else equally awesome. Okay, clearly no Kali Shrine, and I didn't see a key anywhere, so let's go over here just to be sure. Nope. Perfect. I'm gonna be on the next level then. Uh, let's take this rock with us, just to be on the safe side, since we don't have a key to throw around. Okay. Oh, we're only through two levels? Oh, yeah, we died again, didn't we? Dang it. I'm so used to dying that I don't even register the fact that I die anymore. It's like, oh yeah, that was three deaths ago. Oh yeah, I remember now. Back when I got eaten by a spider. Or, or, wait, no. Was it the time that a snake spit on me and my guts went flying everywhere? Or was it the time I got nibbled by a piranha? Ah, I can't remember. There's so many ways to die. Ah, so many ways to die. What a great selling point this game has. Dude, did you ever play Splunky? No, why? Is it good? Yeah, man. There's so many ways to die. It's incredible. Wow, that sounds awesome. I need to buy me that game. Yeah, you do. Okay. Clearly. Perfect. 
perfect. So let's grab... Ooh, that... What's that gonna be? 1,000? Wow. Oh, wait. Wait. Dog, why do you have to be... Like, there's Callie and there's... Why do you have to be next to an explosive crate? That makes things slightly less convenient. That's okay. I'm still pretty good. I've got... Shoes... I've got a parachute. Let's not forget the parachute for that stupid uh, look, jumping without looking uh, routine that I sometimes do. And by sometimes, I mean usually. Okay, let's grab more money so we can buy ourselves a jetpack if we absolutely need to. Um, or if we find a jetpack that we can buy, clearly. Um, it's helpful to... It's easier to buy a jetpack when you can find a jetpack to buy. It's amazing how that works. Crap. Okay, is there a dog over here? Nope. And we can just climb right back up. Perfect. And... Oh, no, don't... Join it! Ah, uh, game! Perfect. Get the key. Not a skeleton. Not a living skeleton, anyways. Jetpack? Oh, let's get that out of the way. Jetpack? Nope. Bombs. Still good. Still worth it. I'm still gonna buy some. Okay, here's the thing. If I... Okay, it doesn't make it mad. Okay. Good to know. So let's buy... One bomb. Two bomb eggs. Ten bombs! That and thirteen ropes. Plus climbing gloves. That should get us pretty far in life. Theoretical. Far. Dog, I need you to set off an arrow trap. Please. Um, very carefully. Thank you. Oh no, dog! That didn't work very well for you, did it? And all it got me was a... Uh, all I got was a flippin' parachute. Okay. You know what we're gonna do? Like that. I don't even care about the money anymore. Now that my dog's dead, I just don't care. Hey, we're in the jungle! We're one third of the way there, and I can't see anything. Perfect. Who wants to see anything anyways? Seeing is not actually believing, contrary to popular belief. Okay, so we have to do this very carefully and very strategically. Oh, that's a bat. Oh, that's a key. Dang it. So what we need to do is... Um, really? Really? Okay. And we'll go over here and grab the torch. And we still can't get out of here. Perfect. Well, we'll make our own exit. That's how you make an exit. Explosives make the best exits. And we'll come down here. Oh, there's... Okay. I was like, I hear a frog. And the frog just fell. Cool. Let's go get our key. I don't really care about the dog at this point. I just want to make it alive. If at all possible. It's amazing how much better uh, this game goes when you can actually stay alive. Okay, so let's... Okay, kill that. Come here, frog. One more jump. Ugh, perfect. Oh, where did the key go? Perfect. Okay, even better. Ugh. Awesome. Okay, let's light our way just so we know what we're looking at. Perfect. Oh my gosh, so good. So we'll bring our dog over. You know what? I don't even care about this. Oh yeah, we definitely don't care. All that is is uh, climbing gloves, which we already have. We don't need it. We don't need it. Okay. Whew. We made it through a dark level. Oh, and there's Callie. Perfect. Dog, I sense sacrificing is in your future. If I can find you. 
Oh, I found you. Dog, have I got a surprise for you. Let me put the key right there. Dog, I have the best surprise for you. You are absolutely going to love it. It's going to be fabulous. Come on. Perfect. Hey, guess what, buddy? Have I got a surprise for you. Woo! She seems happy. That's right, she does. Hey, would you like an idol, too? Oh, what? Is the monkey pooping out gold? Oh my, oh my gosh, the monkey poops gold! I didn't even know that was a thing! Oh my god! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my god! I, did, I honestly didn't know you could give her an... Oh my gosh, you silly monkey! Can I... Can I sacrifice you? No? Oh my... Oh my... Oh, this is the best thing I've ever found in my life! Oh my gosh, little monkey! Do you, like, come with me? Or do I just sit here and let you keep pooping out gems? <laughs> oh my gosh! You have no idea how happy I am right now! This is so... I, I, I need to, I need to go, but I, I just can't leave you. Oh my gosh, you cute little golden pooping monkey. Oh my gosh. My life is complete. My life is absolutely complete. You know what? Screw this. We're... Kelly, don't get mad that I'm doing this. You're fine, right? As long as I don't kill your altar, you're happy. Okay. Um, you have to worry about... Let's... This is why we invested in a lot of bombs. Oh, you cute little monkey, you. And we're totally on the wrong side. Okay, don't accidentally get blown up, please. I would hate for that to happen to you. You're such a cute little monkey. Golden poop monkey. Oh my gosh, golden poop monkey. Okay, we gotta go. Will you keep- will you- will you continue to, like, come with me and keep pooping for me? Please! No? Okay. Maybe. Oh, golden poop monkey! Seriously, I have never been more happy in my entire life than that moment just made me. Oh my gosh. I never knew- I honestly never knew that was a thing! Golden Poop Monkey. Please come back and visit again. I just like saying Golden Poop Monkey, to be completely honest. But the whole fact that he was pooping money was... Oh, another Cali Shrine! And a dog... Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm sure I can find some way to screw this up. Okay. Come here, dog. Uh, Toad. Toad. First. Whee! No, no! Okay. Oh my gosh, that was almost bad. Alright, give me a freaking Kapala, please. Yes! Hey, buddy, guess what? I want your blood. Hey, guess what else? I want more blood. Woo! You know what else I want? Um, um, oh crap! Oh crap! No! Oh, that was almost bad. Okay, let's stop playing around and let's be serious about life. And by serious, I mean let's donate one more body because that should give me enough blood for an yes, extra life. Is there anything else we can donate? No. Okay. I'm sure we'll find more things to kill. Oh my gosh! I want another golden poop monkey though. What do I have to do for golden poop monkeys? Okay. So, I still have to be somewhat smart. Contrary to popular belief, Kapala does not equal infinite lives. It just equals a lot of free lives. Come on. Nope. Crap. Oh, crap. 
Okay, wait for this guy to turn around. Yes, drop. Oh, crap, no, no, no! Oh my gosh, no! Ah, I was totally ready for it, and he turned around too quickly? We almost made it to the ice caves with our key! Oh, man! Alright, we've got to do this one more time. Next episode. I said we were only going to do one more episode to get the key to the temple, but we've got to do it one more time. So, I'm going to say thanks as always for watching, guys. I have a frog in my throat. <clears throat> and I will see you next time. And until next time, don't you dare be a stranger.